Hello and welcome back to another episode of Europa Universalis 4 as we continue our game with Germany. Uh, in the previous episode we declared war upon France to take uh, Zurich. We actually were able to make peace already with Brabant and with uh, Hungary and now we are trying to make peace for that province right there which is hard because we are gaining only one diplomatic power per month. Yeah, that's that's really really bad so we need to finish this war as soon as possible and maybe try and take Zurich because well that's war goal and it will give us more imperial authority so let's try and do so as fast as we can possibly can I also send uh, an army all the way that around around here to try and uh, well crush those guys there we apparently have military access with Russia do we yes we do Ah, god dang it. <laughs> Alright. That's fine. We needed it anyway, but... Let's move there. This should probably be fine. A boundary dispute. Uh, against whom? Against Brabant. Sure, let's press the issue. And... Alright, alright, alright. They are retreating to here. Grab these guys, force march there. Come on. And they went almost all the way and to Summerland. So let's get there. There we go. 21% war score, not too bad. Let's uh, re recover here and then we'll move here and try and crush those guys. Uh, how thoughtful bribes are behind me? Sure, how thoughtful. How thoughtful. Give me money. They will keep voting for me though. So not entirely sure what the heck was that about. Well, they actually went and struck at us. Huh. Well, good luck with that. Honestly, good luck. They are now retreating to Holland. So let's go there. Force march there, please. There we go. And they will be retreating to Scan. Force march yet again. And there we go. The French army is no more. Uh, so let's see what kind of pistol we will, would we be able to make. Let's take Zurich. Well, we can actually do this. I cannot do this though. So let's take Zurich. Or, yeah, we'll take it and sell it to Switzerland. And, well, let's make them release what I wanted in the last one, in the last war, Guyen, make them release Guyen, and maybe Toulouse, there we can, yes, terrific, and Provence, oh, oh, really, how much money do you have, alright, this only costs 7, no, 8, no, 4%, they would release a 4% guy, and a 3% as well, of course, 4%, 4%, well, let's actually release it there. Send this demand and we will be through with this war. There. Germany gains a claim on Zurich as planned. Uh, fine. And, yep, we are going to do that. I'm just going to start coring it. Right now. I'll revoke the protection. Uh, uh, there we go, influence, that was it. Revoke there, revoke guarantee here as well. I have no diplomats, so let's actually do this. Take a good look. This will be the last time you'll see Germany like so. And we can actually take this up. Let's take it first. And switch this to... Um, hmm. Let's get to Arme Blanche, maybe. Yeah, I want the cavalry for the the shock, so yep, definitely. And nation decision, no. Administrative, sure, I'll take it. And here we go, guys. In the year of our Lord, 1697, the most serene Augustus Leopold I Ferdinand von Hauen... Hauen... Ah, goddammit. Hauen Zollern. Romano, uh, Romanorum Imperator, crowned by God, has again governed the states of the Holy Roman Empire. The Diet has agreed to a motion to unite the disparate, 
disparate states of the empire into a nation state and recrowned the emperor as its hereditary ruler, claimed the, claim the crown. So this is it. Claim the crown. And we'll see what happens. Whoa! A throne inherited, a throne inherited, Casus Belli. We lost it, we lost them, we inherited the thrones, inherit, inherit, inherit. We got the revolutionary war against Milan and Tuscany. We inherited Styria, Switzerland, Wittenberg, Milan, Brabant and the Netherlands. This is our land right now, Holy Roman Empire. This is it. Now we do have a, <laughs> a lot of uh, troubles with religious unity. We will do so, uh, well, we will, we will uh, reconvert them. Uh, bit by bit but well that is terrific and we actually need to pass this reform right now missionaries uh, strength plus one so we can actually convert those provinces and Lombardia we can't actually convert even with that we are losing money though uh, one well not that much as you might think mostly because well we are not actually over the force limit but there is a lot of army so I'll take a lot of time to actually make this uh, count we are we have 12 well let's wait for a little while burgundy entered the coalition against us uh 12 out of 6 kaiser not just the name and ruina in perai all right two, two achievements <laughs> apparently if you if you if you make this you'll get two achievements all right a, a month has passed we are still paying a lot for this so let's see actually our relations uh, leading vassal against Lorraine, Salzburg, Cleves, S. All right. Leading union with there. Uh, we need to revoke course in Northum well, revoke revoke current D in Northumberland. We need to do so uh, with these guys. We need to do so with these as well. Well, these are actually done, but this one is not there. Now this should be uh, better. Not entirely healed up, but better. Military access and royal marriage. Oh, all right. That's why we had the military access there. It didn't really interest us not to have. Uh, let's break royal marriage with France and Great Britain, maybe. Tuscany, do we have... Excuse me, do we have... Yes, revolutionary war. All right, Hungary and France. Let's break the royal marriage with someone soon, but not right now. We are gaining two per month. That's low. Right, let's get all of these guys I can merge together, with the exception of the large ones, namely this and this, and yep, we'll m move all of those there. Let's see if the other 48,000, where is the other 48,000? No, it stopped. All right, so let's see if everyone is moving. Zero. All right, this guy go to hell right let's just put them all there and we'll see what we can do hungry entered coalition yep we grew a lot so it's only natural that they uh, join the coalition against us all right Oof. ton of troops moving there more than a hundred thousand troops moving there though 48,000 we have a troop one troop here so let's move these guys to where they belong shall we uh, there there we are now making money and a lot and let's get to Newmark as well all right our manpower is enormous right now a revolt in liege we will deal with it soon uh, let's get these guys here all right, charge again. Twenty-five prestige. All right, all right. Let's merge all of this. Okay. Oh, and we have more fleets. Kind of forgot about the fleets, didn't I? Let's actually grab all of them. If you guys, if you guys didn't know, don't know what I did, I pressed Shift after selecting a, a, a fleet, and then I'm moving them all over there. I'm really tempted, sorely tempted to switch my capital over here. I'm sorely tempted to do so. Because uh, here we will be able to uh, make patrol over here and make a lot more uh, money come to here. Because this is an end trade node. So 
I'm sorely tempted to do so and I might actually do it might actually do it all right now our guys all right everyone is there where is our other army though 48,000 48,000 and 48,000 where are you oh you're moving the over there all right excellent supplies terrific let's merge all right so what shall be our goal for now our goal for now will be to converge these provinces, all of them. Uh, don't, we don't actually... Yes, we have mercenaries. So let's uh, select the mercenaries and do so. Like so. This is actually a mercenary as well. Let's cancel this. Let's hope they are no longer uh, building mercenaries. Let's actually see. No, they are not. Good, good, good. I don't think they are. No, good. This is being gorged. Terrific. Alright, alright, alright. Our goal right now will be to achieve internal stability. That means no overextension whatsoever and no... Uh, not, not one thing out of this. Uh, we need religious unity at 100%, although Lombardia will be tricky to convert. Lombardia. 17 base tags. Oh crap. Oh god damn it. That is a lot. A lot, a lot, a lot. Who 17 base tags. God damn it. Oof. That is a lot. National decision improve improve fort defense. School of establishment. This will get Production, uh, optimism, no. Licensing of the breath, press. Surf them, nope, we cannot do that. Gold standard, master of mint, that we can do. Militia, we really do need that. Recruiting, manpower and recruitment time but stability cost, no. Church taxes, nope. Superintendents, national revolt risk, oh, right. We don't actually have a guy to convert, do we? She's a bummer. We have quite a few revolts right now, but we don't have any guy to convert. That's a bummer. Uh, I will maybe claim the Defender of the Faith. This will give technology cost plus 5%. And we are no longer getting those bonuses. Only the University. So we might actually go for Innovative next to get that bonus right there. Uh, let's take this though, because we already checked. Uh, innovative or religious? But, uh, religious right now, I shouldn't do it, but missionary strength plus 3 is actually very handy. Ah, oh, goddammit. Alright. Uh, hmm. Alright, let's put these guys in rebel suppression. And third army. Oh, really? Another thousand men? Alright, oh, there. That's fine. Now, I'm not considering in improving this as of yet, because as of yet they are doing fine, aren't they? So we have uh, 13,000 and I need 7,000. Alright, so let's uh, start to create units. This is 24 out of these guys, so 24, come on, 24, I think it's 24, or 25, 25. Uh, Let's reorganize like so. 25. Now 7. 7 of uh, cavalry. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And 16. Is it 16? Yes. Reorganize. 16. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 14, 15, 16. Right, so we have already one army here. That's good. That is good. We have an army there. That's terrific. And right here, we can't actually do anything. We need more artillery. And I'm actually happy with that. So let's split in half. Let's reorganize this. I'll, I'll drop this to seven. Select this unit and disband it. And the other one, reduced to 7. 
7, select this unit and kill off these. Alright, so now uh, Brandenburg has... nope. Did I not make an army? A fully army one? Maybe not. Local manpower, well that's actually not not handy for what I want. Let's get, let's put these guys here and now let's see what we need to get that. 25, so I need 4 more here, so 4 more here, 7, it's done, and now I need 14, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, there. This will be that army over there, and Rupin is, nope, new mark, nope, nope, nope. Really, I haven't freaking done one, ugh. Alright, we'll have to live with it then. I really haven't. So we will recruit only there, apparently. And right now we are gaining two. I need to break a couple of things, don't I? Alright, let's put our leader in charge of an army. Uh, let's take this guy out from there. Alright, just gonna claim the defender. That's fine. Lost the general. We will need to recruit another one, but not right now. Alright, so we are converting. Good. Uh, Glau. Nope. Glau Morgan. Nope, not Glen Morgan. It was somewhere around here, wasn't it? Grau, not Glau. Huh, we actually keep kept those. Oh, interesting. Very interesting. We actually kept those. So this is done. Uh Lombard, Brescia. Twenty seven months. Lombard, yeah. Well twenty seven is the most, right? No. Bohemia is actually the most. We'll keep. We'll start with the low ones, 12 months, which is actually not that low, but we'll start with those. Francis Guerrero von Brunei. I'm actually going to take this. I really do need to do need more uh, missionaries. Missionaries. So, all right. Russia. They hate us. With Oh, they should. Friends, minus 200. One monarch dead. Ooh, death. We will get a personal union with them. Well, that can come in handy if we are able to get there, but I sincerely doubt it. So apparently we will have a lot of armies. Let's drop the maintenance, though, so we can get a bit more money. Uh, yep, we'll drop it all the way there. It's half, more or less, right? The morale of armies plus one. Well, actually, plus one. There. That's half. Let's see our council. Three. Uh, yearly prestige, revolt risk, no. Trade power, diplomatic reputation. Uh, technology. Hmm. Keep going. Seventy-eight. All right, let's build something. Uh, Utrecht. Holland. Well, we can make him Utrecht our capital or Antwerp. Huh. Or Oland our capital. That would be really interesting. Let's see the accepted cultures. Alright, so no non-accepted cultures with the exception of these right here and maybe here as well. Hungarian. Alright, rebels have crossed the border. Uh, Gors. Someone will go there soon, so no worries. Uh, let's actually see if this guy has a general. Yes. I should have put uh, our uh, ruler there, though. Yeah, 
Yeah, this guy right here is terrific. Really want that guy up. Let's put our ruler in charge of the uh, a unit. And uh, let's get going. This guy, three, no. Lost Revolutionary War against Riga, that's fine. Sale of titles, let's get stability. We have money, so let's get stability. I'll actually put a cut right here and I'll figure out what our next move will be, what our next goal will be. If uh, take Rome, for instance, that could be a, an interesting an interesting um, goal or to uh, try and rec recreate the Roman Empire and this time I'm not talking about the Holy Roman Empire but the uh, Roman uh, Empire of the old times we can actually try to do so but we start a lot late so we won't actually be able to do it but well we can get a lot out of it and that could, would make for a fine for a fine goal and for a fun goal so we'll see uh, by the way if I want to integrate 1708 all right if I wanted to I'm not entirely sure that I want to integrate Sweden though so this is the world right now Spain and Portugal divided the South Americas and they are dividing the North America with Great Britain as well so yep this is it uh, this is it for my part from this episode hopefully you guys enjoyed it and if you did please consider giving it a thumbs up it really helps out a lot and I'll see you guys next time so until then do take care and goodbye